taking a video editing break to go pluck out a chin hair. It's a thing. Good morning, everybody. Everybody. Happy Sunday morning. It's Sunday, September September 19th, 8.35 a.m. Uh, Dad is still here with Tala. <laughs> Remember the missing dog toy from a few weeks back? Yeah, so Lily, not Tala, my dad's dog, found it in the backyard. I'm guessing it was buried because it was under a bush we looked in no less than 10 times, if, if not more. But Rebecca was outside with Lily last night. Lily was digging. The next thing Rebecca knew, Lily had the koala bear in her mouth. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, it was found, thankfully. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> I washed it. And it's all clean and it looks good as new and you would never know it was buried in the backyard for like a month. It's just the weirdest thing. Hey guys, anyway. so it's just about three o'clock. We are out for a walk. I guess Bob's football game is over. To be honest, I wasn't paying attention. I was reading, so I don't know. Half time. It's half time, he says. It is about 63 degrees outside. And yes, I have a coat on. I know, right? I'm so excited. <laughs> We're gonna go for a walk in the cool breeze. Hopefully it's been raining on and off all day, so if we get wet, he said hopefully we don't get wet. I don't care, I'm walking anyway. <laughs> It is Monday morning, September 20th. It is 10.55 a.m. I am trying to edit down almost two hours of video clips to something that's 30 minutes or less. Yeah, it's a challenge. Then I have to write the post for the week. I've got to work on a video for a video club that's coming up like in a few days that I haven't done yet. I have to finish working on the video um, that I've been working on using my art foamies and that it's gonna be a busy day uh, drinking my bone broth because yeah I'm gonna need the extra energy I'll be back it's 4 50 p.m. and I finally was able to turn the computer off and shut down the art room <laughs> so I got the vlog edited loaded and scheduled I got the video collaboration filmed edited loaded and scheduled. Big accomplishment. I got the other playing with art foamies video, um, finished, uh, edited, loaded, scheduled. I do think we're going to make it a series. So I'm going to try to think of other new ways we can, um, use our art foamies, print with art foamies and our artwork. So that'll be fun. Um, oh, I got the chores done. I got one more load of laundry to do. We are going to go out when Bob is not done with work hopefully within the hour. Um, and we're gonna do a little bit of thrifting before they close. We have our great nephew Paxton, who is turning two on the 23rd, same birthday as our daughter Rebecca. Um, and um, we are gonna go thrift him a whole bunch of books and see what we can find. If we don't find um, enough, then I'll go thrifting either again um, in a couple of days or I will just go to the bookstore. But I just thought it would be fun to get him some thrifted, um, fun children's books. I also ordered him, of course, a rocket ship backpack because what little boy doesn't want a rocket ship backpack? I'll put a picture here. Anyway, um, this is one of our guest rooms that we have upstairs. So my artwork on the wall work on the wall. Yeah, I really like this one. Pretty proud of that one. Anyway, uh, I have started noticing, I think my dad's kind of moving some of his stuff over here. He left a dog pooper, pooper scooper and rake thing here a few weeks ago. That's outside. Um, he, he, he left one of Tala's dog crates here. So 
since she'll be here probably with him more often than not. And she'll be outside for the most part, unless she's coming upstairs to go to bed with grandpa. So, um, <laughs> it's pretty interesting. He's moving some of his stuff in. I don't know where to go with that. Yeah. I think that's the only room he's put stuff. Yeah. I don't think he left any bathrooms. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to go downstairs and start that little laundry. Maybe do a little reading while I'm waiting for Bob to get off work. And then we're going to go do our thrifting and walking while we're thrifting because we need to get steps in. I only have like 2,000 steps because I've been sitting and filming and painting all day. So um, hopefully we can get some steps in at the thrift store. I might have to have bone broth for dinner because I don't have enough steps. So, you know, that's a thing. But it is what it is. It's all right. I got some really great work done today. And... Let's see, I can't multitask anymore. I just, my brain won't, there we go. Um, had some really great work done today. Pretty proud of the projects I got finished and I uh, can't wait for you all to see the videos. Um, yeah, so it's pretty cool. I do have some people out there thumbs downing the videos, but you know what? That means they're watching them, right? <laughs> so I'm all right with it. It's interesting. All right, that's it for the minute. I'll be back. Did yet today? I don't think so. I spent most of the morning chatting with friends and supporters on uh, in our Facebook chat room, and um, <clears throat> we picked up, I told you, a bunch of books for our great nephew Paxton for his birthday, and I ordered him the rocket ship backpack. I was so excited. It should be here tomorrow. Um, but I spent the morning cleaning up the stack of books that we bought for him at uh, the Goodwill, and um, I love getting books used, especially children's books, and I love the variety of unusual titles that you can find, and, um, you know, for kids' books, I don't think you necessarily have to buy new ones, and plus, you know, especially if you're on a limited budget, you can take that same amount of money and buy a lot more books, usually at the thrift store, than you can at the bookstore. Um, anyway, so I did that most of the morning, and then I worked on um, a couple of other things while I was chatting with friends and supporters. So let me just go back upstairs because I just realized just now I forgot to vlog. I didn't get very many steps in yesterday. So when Bob is off of work, I'm hoping we can make up for that a little bit. I've only got a couple thousand steps for today too. Uh, let's see. So I got uh, September Mission Inspiration printed and I've got it pasted into the journal. I'm going to work on that probably tomorrow and try to get that filmed. And also the mid-month mini mission, its card is all ready to go. So I'm hoping to get those done tomorrow or Thursday, but definitely before Friday. And then I did a year of my life journal page um, with um, about the KISS concert. So the red and white strips of tissue in the background are from confetti that they blew out at the concert. And uh, I collect, of course, I collected some and put that on the journal page along with some paint and some art foam. I have an art foamy. It's not my design. It's one of the other artists' designs. But that little swirly white thing in the background, um, that's one of the art foamies. Um, if I can find it, I'll link it down below for you. Um, I printed some KISS images and I printed a copy of my... Uh, to get them from my phone and pasted those in and then did a little bit of journaling on some lined paper. Um, so because of COVID, it's a t it was a ticketless concert. So you had to have the ticket on your phone, no paper tickets. And you had to wear a mask. You had to maintain social distance, which was funny because nobody really did. But anyway, we, we were as safe as possible. Plus, we're all fully vaccinated. So anyway. Um, I got all that done. I also took the rest of the art foamy images I was working on. And if you haven't seen the video yet, I will link it down below uh, what I do with these. But I had a bunch of extra images that I showed in that video. And I took and I cut some more of the copper tape into quarter inch strips and then framed them out and put the little string on top. So now I've got a big stack of them. And I am working on some gifts for patrons and supporters. Um, so I think those might go in the envelopes. Okay. Um, so yeah, I got, I feel like I got a good amount of stuff done along with 
chores and, you know, I think it was a pretty good art day. Yeah, I love the art kiss page and the way it came out. So uh, anyway, other than that, I've just been sitting watching the tubes, the YouTubes. Because, you know, as one does. <laughs> Good morning people, it is Wednesday morning, September 22nd, I think, hold on, September 22nd, okay, yes, I'm in the car again, I'm out running some errands I need to run, I need to get birthday cards for one, because we've got a bunch of birthdays coming up, um, it's been a busy day, I didn't expect today to be so busy. Anyway, got all the chores done. Got the sourdough starters, both the regular and the gluten-free. Fred, F Fred, fed, and they're doing their thing on the kitchen counter. It is kind of a cold, chilly day, so a little bit. So it might take them a while. They might need to sit there for extra time. Got the kitchen cleaned up, had some lunch. Had a little chit chat with one of my neighbors. Um, she will be left unnamed, but she is suffering from breast cancer. She's going through treatments at the moment. She's had her surgery. Everybody send her some love and good energy. Holy cow, she's going through a lot. Anyway, we have an upcoming HOA meeting. We need to elect new board members. I might put my name in the hat. I know it's probably a mistake, but anyway, we'll see. spoiled dog at all. Good morning everybody. It is Thursday, September 23rd, our daughter's birthday. Happy birthday, Rebecca. Love you very much. And our great nephew's birthday, Paxton. He's two. Happy birthday, Paxton. Love you too. Um, it is 9.46 a.m. and I am making, let's see, where is it? Over here, drying in the corner, some gift wrap for Paxton's present. Rebecca's is downstairs. I'm also printing from an Etsy shop a A5 calendar pages for 2022 for my planner uh, for work in YouTube. Um, you know, it was $1.92. It's worth it for me to pay the $1.92 to the Etsy seller rather than try to create one myself. I just, anybody who knows me and has been follow me for a while or friends with me for a while knows I detest making the calendar pages every year for my my planner I just really hate it so um and Webster's pages seems to be always sold out I have a Webster's pages a5 planner by the way so I'm just like printing them from a Etsy seller that works for me uh just basic black and white they don't need to be fancy so anyway I'll be working on that today and getting that cut and punched and wrapping Paxton's present when everything dries and those sort of things. Uh, Letty is here downstairs, our friend and person who helps us keep the house clean. She does a fabulous job, by the way. If you're in the Portland, Oregon area, you need a recommendation. I have one for you.
right, everybody. Bob is back from his appointment and we are taking nut balls over there, crazy pants. Not Bob, the dog. <laughs> um, out, for, out for a walk. Um, she was very good with Letty today and she likes Letty. She had, we made sure to go to Letty every hour or so to get pets from Letty. And then she was fine with Letty being in her second house, you know, our house. Anyway, we're gonna go get some steps in and then, I don't know, we'll figure out what we're gonna do for dinner. I'm not that hungry. I might just have a cup of broth, I don't know. All right, I'll be back. Good morning, everybody. It is Friday morning, September 24th, just after 9 a.m. And I am gonna go walking and get some steps in and go garage sailing all at the same time. <laughs> The local senior community across the way from us is having a big community-wide garage sale. I don't really need anything, but I'm gonna go over there and look around, get some steps in. I haven't taken a shower yet because I'm gonna get all hot and sweaty, so why bother? Um, I'll take one when I get back. Uh, I told the husband that and he went and took a shower. So, and he's coming with me, I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> we're gonna go get some steps in. We've got a couple of bags just in case. And of course, wait a minute, hold on. Some masks. And yeah, so we're gonna go check it out, get some steps in, start that day off, the day off that way. And this is a lot of fun uh, way to get steps in, walking and garage sailing. It's my kind of Saturday, uh, Friday. Oh, Friday. Yeah, it's Saturday. not Saturday, tomorrow's Saturday. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll be back. Okay, so obviously we're in the car again, always. Uh, Bob's um, little bonsai tree I ordered for him for his birthday came. He loves it, he repotted it already. It's it was, office. it's in his office. It was missing the little tray that's supposed to go under the plant. And when I let the company know, thinking they would just send me a little tray, they're sending him another bonsai tree. Got so siblings. he's gonna have a pair of trees. He's gonna see about watching some YouTube videos so he figures out how to trim them and all of that stuff. So hopefully he keeps them alive. Cross your fingers, everybody. I gotta learn how to trim my bush. Yeah. <laughs> God, I might have to cut that out. Holy cow. If you don't get it, I'm not explaining. Good morning, everybody. It's Saturday morning, September 25th, 9.41 a.m. I... I had a couple of beers with dinner last night. So when we got home, I didn't do any drawing or anything. I barely got through today's puzzle, last night's puzzles of the day. Um, for those who don't know, we play Word Brain every night. Um, anyway, I did all the drawings today though. I caught up today. Um, and we are just here waiting uh, for the kids. They're gonna come by and pick us up and we are headed up to my dad's. We're gonna be having a fire ceremony to send my mom off. It's the final thing in that whole process, I think. And having a brunch with the family and all of that stuff. And we don't have to drive. <laughs> the kids are driving, yay. So we're just waiting for the kids.
guys, it is just before 11 o'clock on Saturday evening. We've been home for a little bit, um, just relaxing. It was a good day. We had fun with the family. Um, performing the fire ceremony was really nice. I still smell like cedar and sweet grass. Yeah, my hair smells like it's been near a bonfire. And um, for whatever mm -hmm. reason, the sage, yeah. For whatever reason, my mom, <laughs> if you believe in it, my mom and her spirit were there and blowing all the smoke from the fire directly in my face. And so, yeah, anyway, that was a thing. <laughs> But it was a good day and um, it was a nice day spent with family. So it's been a good week. I hope you had a good week. And um, if you didn't, I hope next week is better for you. Please stay safe, stay healthy, stay creative. Check out the video description for relevant links. My link tree lists the links of where you can follow me on social media, support the free content here on YouTube by shopping in the Etsy store, maybe taking a class that I'm teaching, uh, become a patron over on Patreon, there's a bunch of different ways. Um, and so check that out. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And above all, go out and have a great day. Have a great week. Do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. I'm going to go to bed because it's late. I'm tired. I'll see you next week. Bye, guys.